time for the 49ers Rush Podcast. And, you know, it, it's not a great start from Lance. Now, you get the ball back with 38 seconds left because your defense did their job. And now this is where Trey shows up. You put him in easy situation, two-minute drill, quick passes, and guess what happens? The dude opens up. Finally throws that slant route, which he was a little hesitant to uh, throw earlier, which we saw. And sure enough, man, empty set, throw this slant route. This is a dime right here. I mean, this is just, you see it, you got the cushion, puts it right on the money. That's a hell of a confident pass right there. Let's go, let's go, two-minute drill. Sometimes you got to get people out of their own heads. Make it easy. Now, they got to delay a game call because they were trying to take the ball away from Debo and trying to run the clock and all that stuff. Stop the clock for us, which was nice. Boom. I mean, that's a perfect ball. How many times do we see, you know, selling slants over the middle? That's maybe a thing of the past, hopefully. <laughs> Get the ball down over the middle. And you can see right there, I mean, a little bit higher would be all right, but that's okay because you're leading him where he needs to go. Nice catch there by Debo. First and 10, nice pass. 28 seconds left. Make some easy plays for him now. Another empty set. Hasty's in there. Looking left here. Hasty's coming across the middle. What's he looking at? Pressure coming at him. Okay, now it's time to create. And look at this. Wide open right here. Wide open right there. Look at that. You can see what he's looking at. Coming across. Oh, just bad pass. He had Debo. He had Debo. Elongated, I mean, kept the play going. Three-man rush. Debo's right open in the middle. Just threw it behind him. God, that would have been a huge gain. Mm. This, this could have been one of the big highlights of the game. Because this is what he brings. Three-man rush. And we lose to a three-man <laughs> rush. Not too bad by Compton. Could have been a push in the back. But, man, that throw right there. just It's on a rope just behind him. Ah. Second and 10, 21 seconds. I love how Shanahan was like, go for it, man. I wish he'd do this more often before the, the, before the half. Empty set again. Coming out with the ball quick. Oh, that is good. Man, very nice. You'll see Ayuk just find that soft spot in the zone. Gets past the first line of coverage. And you can see he's already eyeing him. I know where I'm going with the ball. That ball comes out quick. Anticipation route. That's a good location. And freaking golly, Brandon Ayuk's unreal, man. Led the team in receiving. A hell of a game. Just looked good start to finish. Four catches, 94 yards. Anytime you're getting 20 plus, what do you have? 23 and a half yards per catch. That's pretty incredible. And a lot of that's just Ayuk creating on his own. But this is a great ball. Great ball. Understanding the coverage. And you can see him letting that ball go right there. Whoop. Threw it right on the money, man. That ball got there in a hurry. That was a rope, man. 14 seconds left. Got out of bounds. No timeouts. You're in field goal range now. Don't risk it. Any points are good points. Man, he just lays it up there for Ayuk. And Ayuk almost makes a hell of a catch. But, man, this is a ball that we have not seen as 49ers fans. You don't see this. The fade route versus one-on-one -on -one coverage. This is what every team does to the 49ers defense over and over again. When we run that single high safety or a cover three or whatever you want to call it, other teams, this is a gimme. This is one-on-one. -on -one. I'm going to trust my guy, and I'm going to put the ball where only he can get it, and maybe something great can happen. Maybe he makes a one-on-one one-handed catch. Maybe we get a pass interference call. This is a brand-new element to the 49ers offense that we have not had. Did it reward us here? No. But, man, just the idea of a defense saying, all right, this kid will take the top off if we're not careful. That's a hell of a ball. This is a hell of a ball. Ooh, almost made just a circus catch, man. But, man, you keep throwing those up, good things to happen. Because pass interferences, as we know, <laughs> more than most, get called a lot in this league. But when you press the ball deep, and, man, look at the location. You're trying to hit that pylon. That's It's a target throw. 
Okay, because again, I'm going to throw it to the pylon. If my guy can't get it, it's going to be incomplete. Steps up and just freaking zings that ball out there quick. Didn't get complete. He got both feet in too. Those are great plays. Now seven seconds. This one's a little, yeah. I mean, you want to make it an easier field goal for sure. Ayuk, I don't know how he catches this. A little scary. Get the ball. Oh, we false started. Not ideal. Now you, you're you trying to make your field goal easier. You just made it harder. I mean, that's a 50-yard kick from there. I mean, just the balls to throw this when this guy's sitting there. I don't know if it's balls or stupidity. I mean, the faith in his arm is incredible. And look at that catch. We'll get a better angle on it. Should have been intercepted, but whenever the velocity on that ball is what it is from Trey, it's hard to intercept that from as a DB, right? Debo keeps dropping Trey's passes. I don't say keeps. What a freaking catch. Look at that, man. Look at the awareness. Look at him looking down at his toes. Yeah, you got room, man. You got a lot of room. Look at the catch. And again, you pay attention to the throw. Like, it goes off the fingertips of the defender. Yes. Is this a highly likely to be intercepted? No, it's not. That is a freaking rifle shot that, again, DBs ain't going to be able to handle those. So, yes. Is it a tip pass? Yes. Is that bad? Yes. Is this an interceptable ball? I'm telling you right now. That same situation with 10 different DBs might get intercepted once. I don't know. But this is <laughs> hasty. Got a ticket to the show, man. Look at that concentration. Woo. Look at everybody over here. Like stared at it. No way. <laughs> Look at put his hands on his hips and you got a field goal. So you come out. Now it's time for the second half. You can tell it's a little bit darker. Offense found some rhythm. Trey's calming down. Come out. Let's hit the running game, baby. Oh, nice run through. Nice run through. Nice run through. Watch this block from Kittle here. Very nice. Gets to the second level. Ah, close. He's like defense. Yeah, he wanted defensive holding. Watch right here. 52. Is that merciless? You see how he's grabbing him right here. Yeah, see, so that's defensive holding. Look at him. He's like, come on, man. Throw that flag. That's defensive holding. Come on, guys. Second and eight because it doesn't let him get off the combo block. We struggled running um, out of the first, you know, the first quarter and out of the first uh, second half. Go right back to it. Look at Ayuk. He's got to block D lineman like it's nothing. Gets in their way. Not getting any motions. No movement. Debo's in the backfield. Watch the safety. Watch the safety. Come over the top. There it is. I mean, they, they were loading up on it. Got to get some Debo play action whenever he's back there because teams are just, they're, they're keying on it. Third and six. You know, third and medium. That's okay. Rookie can handle this. Not third and long. We're good. You can see right here, the crease, the throwing lane. Gets that ball out. Boom. <laughs> oh, it gets there quick, boy. Woo. When he makes up his mind, that ball gets there in a hurry. You can see. Okay, there's the throwing motion. And he's just going to hit it right here. This defender never had a chance. I mean, he got close. But man, he put that ball. You have no choice but to catch that. I guarantee you, Brandon Ayuk felt this one. I mean, the impact that ball made on his shoulder pads, just like, goosh. <laughs> like, and then he's going to create af afterwards. To say that he creates afterwards, that's a little bit of an undersell. Watch where he catches this ball, okay? Boom. Catches this ball right here, let's say 34. One missed tackle, two missed tackles. It makes him miss again. 34, that's 16 yards. 21 yards. Gosh. I mean, it just keeps going. Gets tackled at the 32. And so just kept going, man. So many yards after contact. And that's that's what he brings. Big playmaking yak, right? Yak bros. Yak city. Whatever you want to call it. But this is a nice toss. This is a really nice toss. You'll see the laser from this angle a little bit better. Just Boom. That ball, it's spinning, man. It is spinning. 
Nice pass protection. Watch the throwing lane just open up right here. I mean, you can almost hear it on the film. I mean, it, it looked closer the other angle, the defender. This wasn't close at all. I mean, it's a tight window, but when you can throw the ball like this, this is where you talk arm strength. That ball got there in a hurry. Boom. Keep going, baby. Keep going, baby. Keep going, baby. Look at Kittle downfield. Yes. Yes. Hopefully you enjoyed that breakdown. Now, if you want to finish the rest of that video and hundreds and hundreds of more, head over to our Patreon account. That is where we put up the full breakdowns. That is where we put up everything. You watch every single offense, defensive play from the past two years of the 49ers, not to mention all of the different draft prospects, including film breakdowns of Trey Lance, Aaron Banks, Trey Sermon, all those guys when they were in college as well. Just go to patreon.com slash 49ers Rush Podcast. It's also the best best way to support the podcast thank you guys we'll see you again next time just want to say thanks for watching and supporting the 49ers rush podcast channel if you haven't hit subscribe yet please do so in the middle of the screen now and here are a few extra videos if you want to check that out for some more 49ers content just want to say thank you and as always stay strong faithful